The Artie Rabin Basketball Center is the first in a series of five courts donated by Artie Rabin of New York. The location of the courts are in southern Sudan, an area torn by 22 years of war with the north. Two million people were killed in this war, and all athletic facilities were destroyed. Most of the people in the area are illiterate, and many do not even own a pair of shoes. The purpose of the court is to bring people together so that they will begin to get interested in communities, in education, hygiene, and health, as well as sportsmanship. Polino Akwe is executive director of the center that houses the Artie Rabin Basketball Center. Most of the young people have been traumatized uh, during the wartime. Others witnessed the dead bodies. Our young people are, they are losing their the livelihoods. So we decided to bring them together to play. Due to the heat and the temperature of the concrete, most of the basketball and volleyball have to take place in the early hours and late hours of the day. There is no basketball court within 100 miles of the Artie Rabin court, and there are very few throughout the entire country of almost 9 to 11 million people. This is uh, the best construct basketball court in northern Barcazal state as well. Uh, before, even before war and after war, there is no any single uh, basketball court in Northern Barcazal State as well. We have already formed the teams, the team are ready. What we are working on them now, we want the, the center to be well organized, all the facilities will be there. By then, uh, the team will be ready for training if we, res uh, if we get the funds. The basketball court is designed as an early point of intervention for literacy, for health, for hygiene, and to develop a peaceful community. The basketball court will uh, help in the term of illiteracy in the area. Seen already in uh, the whole state, which is uh, well populated and the biggest state in South Sudan, and majority, uh, let me say, 60% uh, of, uh, of the young people are not educated and in terms of coming them together it will be able to change even social uh, behaviors will be changed from the young people. Sports, literacy, hygiene and preventive health care are the foundations of the Artie Rabin Basketball Center and in working with Christian Solidarity International there is great hope in the community for the first time in almost a quarter of a century.